大陸條嘅 Part B 咧，其實仲有一個變奏咧，我想獨立抽出嚟咧，同大家講一講嘅。咁啊，當初啦 ，Johnny 就冇做到第二步啦。咁我哋咧就睇翻成條曲線咧，就會向下喐咗啦，或者向左喐咗啦。而嗰個數字咧就唔再係零點三 M 噶啦，咁樣咧就可能去到零點二五 M 啦。咁而家我想講嘅變奏咧，就係、是、第二步 Johnny 做翻啦。但系呢，佢就造漏咗第五步、哦，即係话佢將啲薯条咧浸咗喺个唔同浓度嘅蔗糖溶液之后，浸完两个钟，一拎出嚟唔抹干佢就直接拎去磅啦。咁究竟啦，对于我哋成条曲线啦，或者对于我哋头先系 Part A 所去推算出嚟啦，嗰、那个特定蔗糖溶液嘅浓度。啊！呢、这個溶液呢，佢有同個薯仔細胞呢，有同一個水勢呢。呢、这個數字啦，有冇啲咩嘅變化呢？其實呢條題目呢，個思考邏輯就係、是，如果 Johnny 冇做到第五步嘅時候啦，浸完個蔗糖溶液即刻拎去磅嘅話呢，即係喺個薯條表面啊，其實都仲係有嗰啲蔗糖溶液響樹㗎嘛。咁即係話啦，每一個數字呢，都應該係會重咗少少嘅。咁又要立每個數字呢，都係高咗少少啊嘛，咁所以成條曲線呢，就會向上移動，或者好似向右移動咗啦。而個數字呢，亦都唔會係零點三 M 咯，就會高過零點三 M。咁啊，例如啦，去到零點三五 M 啦。咁其實做呢啲科學探究嘅題目呢，做啲咩嘅變奏呢？例如啦 ，Step One 同埋 Step Four 咧，都有嘢可以問㗎喎。點解我哋要將個薯仔切成薯條呢？而我哋將呢個薯條切成一片片又得唔得呢？有啲咩嘅好處呢？又或者去到 step four 擺兩個鐘太耐啦，有冇辦法加快佢呀？同將個薯條變成一片片有冇關係呢？又或者啦，得閒無事搞下佢又得唔得呢？又或者將嗰個溶液將個温度提升少少又得唔得呢？提升幾多呢？或者阿 Johnny 將整個裝置唔覺意擺咗落雪櫃嘅話啦。咁對於個結果又有啲咩嘅影響呢？其實一個實驗呢係可以千變萬化，無論任何你諗到或者諗唔到嘅錯處呢，其實都可以發生嘅，或者一啲失誤啊，又或者喺個實驗當中嘅誤差，其實都可以問你㗎。For the question six part B, there is one more a question variation. I would like to talk about it separately. So in part B, if Johnny skip step two by step for all samples, how would this affect the curve and the deduced value of the concentration of the super solution in part A? So we talk about that the curve would shift downwards or to the left, and the deduced value of the concentration of the super solution will be lower than zero point three m, maybe zero point two five m. And then one more possible question variation is that Johnny did the step two. However, he forgot step five. If Johnny skipped step five by mistake for all samples, stay and explain how would this affect the curve and the deduced value of the concentration of the sucrose solution in part A. The key logic is that if Johnny skipped step five. So there will be excess solution remains on the surface of the potato cylinder because Johnny immersed the free potato cylinder in the sucrose solution for two hours. Then he took it out and directly rewrite the potato cylinders. So there will be excess solution remains on the surface of the potato cylinder, and then it will need to slightly increase in the mass of the potato cylinders. So after calculation, all the results will be slightly higher than the original value. Then the whole curve would shift upward or to the right hand side, and the deduced value of the concentration of the super solution will be higher than 0.3 m, maybe 0.35 m. And for the scientific investigation, there are lots of possible question variation. For example, for step one, it may ask you that what if Johnny cut the potato tubers not in cylinder but cut it into the disc? So any importance or any benefit for this action? Or for the step four, any method to speed up the experiment, immersing the potato cylinder into the sucrose solution for two hours, it takes too long, and I would like to shorten the time. So any method you can suggest for a question is related to the step one, not cut the potato tubers into cylinders. I cut it into disc. So any benefit, or increase the temperature slightly, gently, or what if accidentally Johnny put the whole setup into the refrigerator? 
So what will be the effect? So what will be the effect on the rate of the osmosis? For this video, I want you to have this mindset. No matter the mistake you can imagine or you cannot imagine, they can happen in the scientific investigation. Or any sampling errors can also happen in the scientific investigation.